Hello and welcome to this edition of Illumination. I'm Scott Atwell, president of the FSU Alumni Association, coming to you from one of our open houses that take place before every home football game. If you're going to be in Tallahassee this fall, make sure and stop by the Alumni Association. We're here on Fridays before home football games between 5 and 7 p.m. It's free to Alumni Association members, and it's a great way to get your weekend kick-started. There's lots of FSU spirit delivered by great Seminoles, including the man who wrote the FSU fight song more than 60 years ago. <laughs> about being here on a Friday uh, before a football game with my wife Shara is having a chance to get a nice uh, glass of wine, meet people who we've never met, have a great conversation and find that we have so much in common with folks who we'd never met before. The Alumni Association also stages Friday events during our away games with the help of our network of Seminole clubs around the country. If you'd like to stay up to date on these or to find out where the Seminoles in your city are watching the games, visit the football headquarters on the Alumni Association website. Well, we made sure the season got off to a traditional start with the kickoff luncheon, which has been hosted by your Alumni Association for 62 years now. The marching chiefs, the cheerleaders, and the football team, the coaches, made it a rousing occasion. It's a kickoff lunch and it's, it's always a big festival. I'm Terry Basham here in Tallahassee. I've uh, been here forever and a big Knowles fan, ready for the kickoff for the get this season going. Players are all fantastic. They all got good personalities, mixing with the people, it's fun. Now two days later, we welcomed the freshman class of 2013 with the President's Backyard Barbecue. Nearly 5,000 jamming the venue for a great afternoon of Seminole Spirit, sponsored by the Student Alumni Association. The Student Alumni Association is really excited to be able to be a part of the President's Backyard Barbecue. We work very closely um, with the President's Office to host this event, and it's just a day that we get to welcome the new freshmen into FSU, to welcome them into the Seminole community with open arms, and it's just really exciting for us to be a part of their first experience here at FSU. We promised and we delivered more networking events targeted toward young alumni. This one taking place in Tampa in conjunction with Florida State's Career Center. Nearly 100 Seminoles turning out to hear about local job opportunities from fellow FSU alumni. Another event is planned for Miami in October, but this one was a job well done. You may remember two years ago when our Emeritus Alumni Society spearheaded the creation of a state historical marker commemorating FSU's old West Campus. Well, the Emeritus alumni are at it again and recently met to talk about their next FSU fundraising project and the consensus is something to benefit our fast-growing Veteran Center. We chose it because uh, President Barron has been talking about how important that was, get it, make this a veteran university. We just want to do our part to make it everybody aware. And so what we're trying to do here at Florida State is build something that's very unique and that's a Veteran Center that houses veterans past, present, and future. Bring them together to give them a sense of community. Well, a big shout out of thanks to Seminole great William Floyd for taking part in our Seminoles at Sea Cruise in July. The Royal Caribbean adventure also included a talk by Mag Lab director Greg Bobinger, and all of our Seminoles had a great time. This winter, we're changing gears a bit with Seminoles at Ski, an alumni travel event to Park City, Utah. Head to our website for more information. Also on the alumni website, you'll find our brand new photo walk tour, depicting the iconic images of the Florida State campus. This site is interactive, so snap, post, and share with your fellow alumni. Before we say goodbye, don't forget our communication staff is hard at work on the next edition of Vera's Magazine, which will arrive in your mailbox with a 2014 calendar. Remember, these are exclusive benefits of membership, so if you're not a member, join today at our website, alumni.fsu.edu. That's going to do it for this edition of Illumination on behalf of the 300,000 FSU alumni around the world. I'm Scott Atwell. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you next time.